Tomorrow we will celebrate the annual World Day of Migrants and Refugees, which has as its theme this year, child migrants, the vulnerable and the voiceless. In his message for the occasion, Pope Francis began by quoting Jesus, whoever receives one such child in my name receives me, and whoever receives me receives not me, but him who sent me. And then Pope Francis went on to say, with these words, the evangelists remind the Christian community of Jesus' teaching, which both inspires and challenges. The evangelists reflect also on the responsibility of the one who works against mercy. Whoever causes one of these little ones who believe in me to sin, it is better for him to have a great millstone fastened round his neck and be drowned in the depths of the sea. How can we ignore this severe warning when we see the exploitation carried out by unscrupulous people. Such exploitation harms young girls and boys who are led into prostitution or into the mire of pornography, who are enslaved as child laborers or soldiers, who are caught up in drug trafficking and other forms of criminality, who are forced to flee from conflict and persecution, risking isolation and abandonment for this reason. On the occasion of the annual World Day of Migrants and Refugees, I feel compelled to draw attention to the reality of child migrants, especially the ones who are alone. In doing so, I ask everyone to take care of the young, who in a threefold way are defenseless. They are children, they are foreigners, and they have no means to protect themselves. I ask everyone to help those who, for various reasons, are forced to live far from their homeland and are separated from their families.